Lord Sika Lucius. Cassandra, with a woman I can only assume is the new Inquisitor. And you're the man who betrayed his own order. I presume you know we Seekers of Truth were once the original Inquisition. Oh yes. We fought to restore order in a time of madness long ago, as you do now. And we became proud. We sought to remake the world, to make it better. But what did we create? The Chantry, the Circles of Magi. A war that will see no end. You lured your entire order to their deaths. There was no other choice. No other choice? Have you gone mad? We Seekers are abominations, Cassandra. We created a decaying world and fought to preserve it even as it crumbled. We had to be stopped. You don't believe me? See for yourself. The secrets of our order passed to me after the former Lord Seeker was slain. The war with the mages had already begun, but it was not too late for me to do the right thing. Don't listen, Cassandra. We need to end this. What Corypheus did with the Templars does not matter. I have seen the future. I have created a new order to replace the old. The world will end so we can start anew. A pure beginning. Join us, Cassandra. It is the Maker's will. had to be. The influence of Corypheus, perhaps? Was he trying to disable the Seekers? If so, the plan worked perfectly. He could not have destroyed all of us. I won't accept it. Let us return to Skyhold. I wish to see what's in this Book of Secrets. This tome has passed from Lord Seeker to Lord Seeker since the time of the old Inquisition. And now it falls to me. That's a lot of not very exciting reading, apparently. Do you know what the right of tranquility is? The last resort used on mages in the circles, leaving them unable to cast, but depriving them of dreams and all emotion. 
It should only be used on those who cannot control their abilities, but that has not always been the case. Deprived of all emotion? That sounds... I always thought it a necessary evil. What finally began the Mage Rebellion was the discovery the right of tranquility could be reversed. The Lord Seeker at the time covered it up. Harshly. There were deaths. It was dangerous knowledge. The shock of its discovery in addition to what happened in Kirkwall. But it appears we've always known how to reverse the right. From the beginning. So the Seekers are responsible for the Rebellion, in more ways than one. One more crime to add to the pile. Yes. We created the Rite of Tranquility. To become a Seeker, I spent months in a vigil, emptying myself of all emotion. I was made tranquil, and didn't even know. Then the vigil summoned the Spirit of Faith to touch my mind. That broke tranquility and gave me my abilities. The Seekers did not share that secret. Not with me, not with the Chantry. Not even with... There's more. Lucius was not wrong about the Order. I thought to rebuild the Seekers once victory was ours. Now I'm not certain it deserves to be rebuilt. You said there was more in the book. At some point, power becomes its own master. We cast aside ideals in favor of expedience and tell ourselves it was all necessary for the people. Will that happen to us, Inquisitor? Will we repeat history? We might. It would be lying to say it's impossible. An honest answer, if not a comforting one. I don't think I've ever seen you so shaken. I do not think the Seekers have been doing the Maker's work. Not truly. Perhaps we believed it once. The original Inquisition came to be during a terrible time. But now, we harbored secrets and let them fester. We acted to survive, but not to serve. That is not the Maker's work. If you did rebuild the Seekers, how would you do it? I can't be the only one remaining. We will always spread to the winds, and some may still be out there. I would find them one by one. We would all read this book, no more secrets. Then together we would establish a new charter. The Maker's work in truth. Rebuild the Seekers. Make them better than they were. Thank you. I could not have done this on my own. <laughs>